So, I wasn't planning on making another video, um, for, like, you know, at least a week, let finals week pass or whatever, um, but a friend of mine texted me saying, I should make a video on how to procrastinate, and I was like, I can't do that, I have finals coming up, I have a lot of homework, I got stuff piling up, there's no way I can make another video so soon. And here I am. But before I move on to my tutorial on how to procrastinate, uh, I want to side note a little bit. ADD! So remember how I said I didn't have friends? Well, I was sitting there waiting for my class to start, and a couple of classmates came up, and we were sitting, chilling, talking, whatever, getting Starbucks. It was cool. I had friends. When out of nowhere, this omnious, om, omnious, whatever, this omnious plop I felt upon my shoulder, let me tell you, I was wearing one of my favorite shirts because it was so pink and fun, and I felt cool. Whoa, time out. I just realized I'm wearing the same exact shirt I wore in my last video. That's embarrassing. It's my Pink Floyd shirt. I wear it for bed, I swear. My roommate is laughing at me. I don't know. It's always bothered me when people wear the same clothes, like, four days in a row. It's like, please change your shirt. Please. Mwah. So, just, just so you know, this shirt, yeah, it's a bedtime shirt. If you guys don't wear the same pajamas to bed every night, I don't believe Ugh, now that that's out of the way. Anyway, back to my story. So there I was, sitting there with my friends. I guess we're friends. That sounds weird. It's that awkward pre-friend stage where, like, there's still awkward silences, but you've texted a few times. This is probably why I don't have friends. Anyway, so we're mid-conversing -com or whatever, and, and I look down and there's bird shit on my arm. I mean, I'm already a painfully, horribly awkward person to begin with. I'm finally conversing, connecting with people that I enjoy their company, and a bird shits on me! Like, what? So I look down, and and the, the bench table thing that I'm sitting at, there's, there's like four piles of crap right there, and it's all over the place! Like, they had to have noticed that I was like sitting in piles of shit, that they just like, they just let slide, just like conversed with me anyway. Thanks, I guess. Jeez, Peggy, learn some more words. Conversed, that's the third time. So I look around to see, like, oh my god, this whole thing is covered in bird crap. No, there's there's just one section, like one, like, five inch by five inch square that's just, like, where the birds go to shit. Like, that's it. The the, the rest of the bench is there. No shit. Just, just this. It's my life. So yeah, that's my first story. Uh, that's from yesterday afternoon. This next story is from this very morning. I was in a bit of a rush this morning, so I was running around trying to get things done. I had to go over to meet some professor somewhere. Um, and I, you know, did my normal thing, brushed my teeth, put on my makeup, put on deodorant, put on clothes. And I was about to leave when I was like, oh crap, my wallet. So I went back to my desk to find my wallet. And I looked down, and there, there's this puddle-like squishy white substance on my hand get your mind out of the gutter so naturally my first instinct is oh it's toothpaste because you know i'm not ridiculously running low on toothpaste right now you see this every morning it's like an epic battle to squeeze the last thing and every morning i'm like oh that's it gotta get new toothpaste today and then by the night i'm like ah I could probably squeeze a little bit more out and then of course i don't pick up and the next morning you know in the bathroom like Ugh! and i <laughs> finally get out like another little morsel of this so naturally my first instinct is oh toothpaste is on my hand i'll just lick it off guess what it wasn't toothpaste I'm not a violent person. I don't I don't rip off the deodorant lid and smear it everywhere that I would get globs of it on my hand. How does that happen? Literally how does that happen? Do you ever taste deodorant? It's probably the worst substance to ingest ever. Like <sighs> it feels like you know when you go to the dentist and they put like that evil sucky thing in your mouth and it I was like, dear lord, especially when you're expecting to be sweet, minty, toothpaste yumminess. Not that I, like, normally eat toothpaste, but, I mean, when you're expecting toothpaste and have freaking deodorant. <laughs> so, yeah, that's basically how my morning went. And, uh, yeah, that's, uh, that's how I procrastinate. I'm literally so good at putting things off that I totally let this whole video get away from me and it's all about these two silly stories that happened instead about how to procrastinate. I'll just have to make another one. <laughs>